Hello everybody, welcome back to channel. I'm Cypher and we're gonna talk about my new project ESP32 Thief, which can monitor network traffic, scan for nearby Wi-Fi networks, simulate weekend frames and detect the authentication attacks. So without further ado, let's get into it. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. More about them later on the video. As you watch this video, I've shared the beta version of ESP32 Deep on my GitHub so you can try it out. But I have to point out that it has a lot of bugs and is still a work in progress. To upload the code in the ESP32 microcontroller, I used RX and TX pins of ESP32 so that we can connect it to our computer with the help of a USB 2 TTL. I also placed a SMA antenna for ESP32, however, in this ESP32 model, I cannot connect it to my microcontroller because of the ESP32 integrated antenna. Maybe I will use it later. I used an SPDT or single pole double throw switch for easy on and off. In these mechanical switches, voltage and current can be either directed to the normally open or normally closed terminal. Rechargeability is important to me, so I used a TP4056 in my PCB design so we could charge our lithium battery as well. For the input voltage, I used USB Type-C which can directly charge the battery and power the ESP32 div. To navigate the menu, I used a few tactile switches, a buzzer for future uses, a ST7735 TFT LCD and a NeoPixel LED. My favorite is the 5-way push button that allows us to control the menu as well as other uses but requires very little space. And also let's don't forget to mentioning our microcontroller ESP32. No project is complete without the right tools and materials. That's where our sponsor PCBWay stepped in to provide essential support for this project. PCBWay is a leading provider of high quality printed circuit boards or PCB and PCB assembly services. To learn more about them, please check the link in the description down below. Now that the gadget is ready to use, let me show you what it can do and let's check out the functionality. First, we have the main menu which shows us the four available options. I will add more options in the next version as well. First, we have Packet Monitor. The Packet Monitor allows us to receive the packets and surveillance the specific chosen channel. The information gathered is then displayed on the TFT LCD screen in real time. Second, we have Wi-Fi scanning. The Wi-Fi scanning function detects and lists nearby access points. We utilize the ESP32's scanning functions to retrieve information about SSIDs, signal strength, channels, and security protocols. Next, we have beacon spamming. In this section, by choosing the desired channel, you can create and spam fake Wi-Fi access points. Beacon spamming involves crafting and broadcasting fake beacon frames. This function is for educational purposes, allowing users to understand how networks announce their presence. For the last option, we have the auth detector. In this section, all channels will be scanned for any deauthentication attack and will display the amount of detected packets for every channel. When detected, trigger the buzzer and LED to alert the user. If you like to learn more about this project and try it yourself, visit my GitHub for the code and my website for a detailed blog. Both links are in the description down below. Well guys, that's it for today's project. I hope you like it and it's been useful for you. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out the link in the description down below. And I see you guys in the next video.